I think how I handled it initially, because I, I, when I, when I first was in relationship with you and I still had a lot of um, emotion and trauma held in my body and I would very quickly go into a flooded state or a triggered reactive state. Um, the way I, I figured out how to manage that was to write to you and mm-hmm. to do so very um, mindfully and carefully. You know, mm-hmm. I wasn't like just vomiting, like, angry words like it would take me an hour or two hours even to get it all out send it to you and wait for your response and that's how I um gave myself grace when I I simply couldn't feel safe um face to face Um, and that evolved into you know me saying okay I know you want to write this out but (laughs) It's okay to just speak your truth and right. have the conversation in the moment. Right. And, um, yeah. Yeah. But I, I do think that's a great option um, for people who have difficulty um, finding that observer function in the moment and potentially being able to communicate what you're experiencing and feeling in that moment. In other words, um, you know, getting lost in the reactivity, lost in the unconscious context. And by writing it out, um, and I would actually suggest that, um, at least this has been true for me, that even if you do sort of just vomit it all up onto paper, you know, long before you hit send, what you're going to have is, you know, um, a checklist of all of the contents of your, <laughs> of your trauma, your mm-hmm. unconsciousness, right? Mm-hmm. Um, and you're going to be able to look at that and it is going to provide useful information. Um, Mm -hmm. the problem is, is if you sort of re view that, that list of what you've vomited up out of your unconscious and go, damn right. (laughs) Send. (laughs) Send. (laughs) Well, then, then you're still just lost (laughs) in it. Right. Like (laughs) anytime you're convinced you're right, it's a problem. I think, I think we can just sort of say that that's a, you know, kind of take that one and and stamp it on each other's foreheads. Right. And so that you're always looking at it whenever there's conflict. 